Hi guys, today we are going to learn how to make sneeze guards for our classroom. The materials you need for this project include foam board and these photo frames I purchased from Dollar Tree. You'll need about three foam boards per table, two of the photo frames, and about two and a half rolls of duct tape per table. Next, you need to measure and cut out the shape you want in your foam board. It may vary depending on what clear surface you are using for your foam board. After I cut the desired shape into my foam board, I am ready to tape down the plastic film. I'm just going to use a little bit of scotch tape to tape it down in place and then I will go over it with the red decorated duct tape that I purchased. This is the duct tape I am using to tape down all four sides of the clear plastic window. I taped on both the front and the back so that it would have a nice red decoration. Now it's time to assemble. I take one foam board that I did not cut a window to and can, I'm now going to connect one of the windows onto that foam board directly in the middle of the foam board. The first thing you want to do is measure out the tape you'll need for both sides of that foam board so you won't have to try to hold and cut at the same time. After you have cut your tape, get ready to place it on the foam board at the very edge so that you can tape it down onto the board that does not have a window. I'm making sure the tape is lined up and I'm going to pl place it right directly in the middle of that foam board. Make sure your tape is out so that it does not stick to the other side of your window board. It, place it directly in the middle and smooth it down. Once that is done, you may lay that to the side and get ready to tape the other side. Place that down, smooth it down, and then stand your board up. Now you have a sturdy surface to tape down the other window on the other side. And you'll just do the same thing on the other side with another board that has a window in it. And now you have a nice, sturdy sneeze guard to keep you and your children safe in your classroom. 